The number of trading indicators that's available to any trader that they can slap onto their charts is pretty vast. Whether we're talking about trend indicators such as a moving average or the oversold, overbought trading indicators like the stochastics, uh, trading indicators help us in making sense of the markets that we trade. Now you may be one of those traders who use indicators, but you really don't know much about them like other traders just like you. Now how can we make that a definite statement? Because most traders lose. Now that's not a secret, is it? Right. So I think you can put a combination of indicators together and with strict rules and a trade plan. Winning is not as elusive, and we see it every single day in NetPix. Our trade room and the many testimonials from real traders show that indicators are not a problem because we use them with all of our trading systems. Now, believe it or not, there is one indicator that's going to increase the likelihood of you finding success in trading. This indicator is going to work on any market. It's going to work on any time frame, any size trading account, or style of trading. This indicator has nothing in common with all the other ones that you're going to find in your charting package. This indicator was, it's going to tell you if you stand a chance to succeed as a trader or if you're doomed to lose your capital, like most people who try to trade. And what amazes me even more than the power of this simple, all important indicator is how many people don't even know it exists. And the single most important indicator that you just have to use if you hope to succeed at trading is your actions. Your actions indicate everything you need to know at this exact moment in time for your advancement as a trader. You think about it and you're going to see that it is 100% true. Moreover, it doesn't matter what indicators you put on your chart if you do not pay attention to what your actions are telling you about your trading because it is a realism that no one can escape from. Think about it this way. Actions are the only language worth listening to, not words words are meaningless if they're not backed up by actions listen to the actions that's where the real truth is revealed it's not what someone says it's what someone does and it requires a large dose of humility honesty being humble to be able to listen to what your own actions are telling you yet within the language of your very own actions are the answers to why you are either succeeding or you're failing at trading. What you do indicates several critical things about your trading, as well as what precisely is the next step that you must take to get yourself onto that pathway to success. Now that's a pretty powerful indicator, wouldn't you say? What you do actually indicates why you are trading, what you want from your trading, what you are doing to achieve your trading goals, goals that you might not fully understand if you don't listen to your actions, what you are afraid of, what you respect, what you need to work on to stop losing all the time, and what you need to work on to succeed. Here are some examples that will help you better understand why we put this indicator above and beyond all else over here at NetPix. In fact, they're questions whose answers make my point loud and clear for those with the humility to answer them honestly. Number one, how many times do you intervene with your trade against your trade plan rules? Why do you do that? Number two, did you even sit down and write out even a basic trade plan? Three, did you research it yourself? Did you back test it? Did you forward test it? Did you practice it? This will enable you to believe in and have faith in your trading plan. And one of the biggest actions that we see traders take that's a clear indicator of their ability to succeed is system jumping. And in NetPick, we call this chasing performance. Traders are gonna take a few losses, now, even if they fall in line with the expectancy of the trading plan, and then they toss the trading system away and they seek the next shiny object. How much time have you wasted? Again, that's an action, jumping from trading strategy to strategy, and you're still seeking some type of consistency in your trading. Fear, greed, thrills, it's an action. Those three items are the wrong reason to trade, but I bet if you were critical of yourself, you'll see you've done it at least some of the time. Greed, that's hanging onto a trade, past the obvious exit point because this is the home run trade. Fear. The last trade was a loser, so you skip the next one. You jump out of a losing trade, afraid of losing, only to see it turn in your favor. Thrills. You're just pushing buttons and the flashing lights and the ability to call yourself a trader. That's what you're doing. Your actions will show you exactly what you are looking for in the market. Ed Sakota said this, I think that if people look deeply enough into the trading patterns, they find that on balance, including all their goals, they are really getting what they want, even though they may not understand it or want to admit it. And it took a long time for a lot of us to discover this indicator because we are resistant to the truths that it offers. 
and we're not honest enough to recognize what you're being told by your actions. And once you finally eat that large plate of steaming humble pie, you will finally be able to understand the language of actions and to acknowledge what they are indicating. And at that point, I think you're going to find things start to change for you because we actually do get what we want from the market. And there's only one reason to trade, and that's to make money. Most traders lose money, yet they are getting exactly what they're asking for. Not what they're asking for by the words they speak. No, no, because words are meaningless. Everybody wants the riches, but very few are prepared to suffer the journey to get there. They are getting what they are asking for with the only language that actually matters, their actions. Yet, like any language, it's not so easy to learn how to understand it. To understand your actions, you have to be able to understand yourself. Apply yourself and you can do this. Now, your words say that you want to be a successful trader, right? Well, back that up with actions. If you're honest and you're humble, your actions will be understood and they'll indicate what it is that you need to do to get on the winning track. Then, as Michael Jordan would say, just do it. Your actions are the most single important indicator. If you don't pay attention to them, your chances of succeeding are going to be completely dependent on luck. So if you decide to remain thirsty and just ignore all uh, this important indicators telling you, I wish you good luck because you're going to need it.